Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your, I don't know what this is, but it's going to be a quick reading for you. We're going to pull one card for love. We're going to pull one card for career and finance. Thank you guys for being here. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Capricorn with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what love has to offer Capricorn. Let's see what love has to offer. All right. We've got the lovers. Very nice. Okay. So it looks like maybe you have a choice of lovers. Sometimes this can indicate, yeah, a choice in love. And it's that choice that comes out of nowhere. Maybe this is a past person coming back while you have a now person. So now you got to decide who you want or what you're going to do. This also could be a deciding factor in terms of a life altering change. Should I get married? Should we move in together? Should we have a baby? Um, that's the kind of energy that's coming up with the lovers too. It also says that maybe this is um maybe a very physical connection here. So you're trying to decide if you want something more. Uh, you're trying to decide if you should stay or you should go. Um, this also talks about a soulmate uh, union, and it's a, it talks about choosing the soulmate union. And if you don't choose the soulmate union, it talks about long lasting ramifications. Like you think about this person maybe for a lifetime. Uh, they never go out of your heart space, out of your head space. So um, that's what's going on here in love. Let's see what's going on for Capricorn in terms of career and finance. All right, so we've got judgment here. So um, you got to review something and maybe evaluate. And and this also talks about making a decision here. Review, evaluate, and make, and make a decision. So you got to cut something away, cut it out. You no longer uh, take part in it or it's no longer what you do. This could also be maybe you having two jobs, maybe having to let one go, having two business, having more than one or more than even two. Um, you have to decide what you're going to let go, what you're going to sacrifice, what you're going to maybe resolve or dissolve or also you have to look over maybe what you have done thus far and kind of um, release the guilt, maybe even the shame. Uh, maybe even, uh, you know, maybe the, the embarrassment is what I'm hearing. Uh, also some, for some of you, this is more so the, the, uh, blaming yourself or you have to kind of release that so you can relinquish that move on because it looks like the universe is trying to bring in a new way of doing something, a new way of existing here for you. But what you're um, not allowing is for, uh, the old to, you know, for you to shed all those old emotions and maybe even shed something that is just not working for you any longer. Let it go. Um, and this is also a decision about reviving something from the past. Maybe you used to do something that used to bring in money and you're trying to determine, should I get back into that? Should I do that thing? Should, so it's just more so a deciding factor here for you in terms of career and finance. Yeah. It says that maybe you need to Think about it, weigh the pros and the cons, and then come back to the decision. Don't make it right now. Don't don't make it in haste. Something is a power struggle in your life. So that means that you gotta put more energy, effort, time into one thing, and the other one is not getting as much of you. Something is um falling by the wayside. Uh, one thing is dominating the other. So you gotta decide here what you're gonna do. So this is what I have for you, Capricorn. If it resonates for you go over to the website book there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below you can also catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time um yeah that's what i have for you cap thank you many blessings to you